A newly released image of the interstellar object 3I Atlas has left scientists astonished, revealing behavior in sunlight unlike anything ever recorded before. The image, captured by the MastCam Z camera aboard NASA's Perseverance rover on Mars, shows a faint, blurry glow in the Martian sky, precisely where astronomers predicted the mysterious visitor would appear. This marks the first time 3I Atlas has been observed from such close range. In the image, the object appears as a delicate smudge beside a cluster of faint stars, each only about magnitude 8 in brightness. Supporting data from the rover also indicates movement across the sky that researchers believe corresponds to the interstellar traveler itself. Interestingly, the photograph was not taken at the comet's exact closest approach to Mars. Rather, it was captured one day earlier. Experts explain that only orbiters circling Mars could have properly recorded the true moment of closest passage. However, ongoing administrative delays at NASA mean that those detailed close-up images may take time to be publicly released. During the near flyby of 3I Atlas, the Perseverance rover also documented heightened atmospheric activity on Mars. The footage shows swirling dust devils dancing across the Martian surface and a vast dust storm building along the horizon, hinting at an unusually turbulent environment coinciding with the comet's passage. In the rover's images, the interstellar visitor's tail is barely visible, so faint that it almost disappears against the background. Astronomers note that the object's lack of a prominent tail is highly unusual, as most comets develop one easily visible even from great distances. Yet, as 3I Atlas drew nearer to Mars, a thin, narrow tail did begin to form, still much dimmer and more slender than any previously observed. Other unverified images from ground-based and orbital telescopes suggest that the object might have an elongated form, bearing a closer resemblance to the first known interstellar object, Oumuamua, rather than to the second, 2I Borisov. On October 3rd, the enigmatic body made its closest recorded pass near Mars, approaching to within roughly 0.19 astronomical units, or about 28 million kilometers. Now it is hurtling through space at an astonishing 200,000 miles per hour, heading toward its nearest approach to the sun, a point known as the perihelion. But just as astronomers began to track it more carefully, events took an unexpected and puzzling turn. A massive coronal mass ejection, a surge of high-energy particles and plasma expelled from the sun, appears to have struck or influenced the object. Since then, the comet's brightness and visibility have changed dramatically, leaving scientists uncertain about what exactly has happened to this mysterious interstellar wanderer. But what truly unsettled scientists were its physical characteristics. Even before its disappearance, 3I Atlas displayed behavior that broke the rules of celestial mechanics. Normally, when a comet releases gas or dust, the outflow acts like miniature thrusters, slightly altering its trajectory. Yet, despite clear evidence of gas surrounding 3I Atlas, its orbit remained eerily stable, almost unnaturally precise. Calculations indicated that to remain unaffected by these outgassing forces, the object must possess an immense mass, far beyond anything typical for a comet. Some estimates placed its weight at over 33 billion tons, making it potentially a thousand times more massive than any comet previously observed. The implication was staggering. No natural process known to science should have allowed an object that large and dense to form in interstellar space and still reach our solar system intact. The universe simply doesn't have enough free rocky material drifting between the stars to produce something of that scale. This led a few bold researchers to wonder, what if 3I Atlas wasn't entirely natural? Could it be a fragment of a planet? A relic of a shattered world? or even, as some dared to whisper, something created. One of the most outspoken voices in this debate was Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb, already known for his controversial theories about interstellar visitors. Loeb categorized the anomalies of 3I Atlas into two groups, those that might eventually be explained with more data, and those that might never be explained at all. In the first group, he placed factors such as its faint anti-tail, a forward jet of scattered sunlight pointing toward the sun instead of away from it, and its peculiar chemical composition, which appeared to contain elements more commonly associated with planetary surfaces than icy comets. 
In the second group, he listed mysteries that defied any known natural explanation. Its orbits near perfect alignment with the ecliptic plane, the flat disk in which all the planets orbit the Sun, and its coincidental timing as it passed near Mars, Venus, and Jupiter in rapid succession. Even more unsettling, the direction from which 3I Atlas entered the solar system was within 9 degrees of the WOW signal, the unexplained 1977 radio burst once suspected to be of extraterrestrial origin. While most scientists dismissed this as mere coincidence, Loeb argued that such alignments deserved scrutiny. He wrote, Those who insist 3I Atlas is a typical comet must be held accountable for explaining all of these coincidences through natural processes. The debate has reignited an old question. How do we distinguish between natural and artificial cosmic phenomena? Our instruments can measure trajectories, brightness, and spectra, but they cannot always reveal intent. Could 3I Atlas be a fragment of ancient technology, a derelict probe from another civilization weathered by eons of travel between the stars? Or is it a relic from the early galaxy, an ancient shard of rock forged before our sun even existed? The truth, for now, remains elusive. What makes this object particularly fascinating is not just its mass or its path, but the way it interacts with its environment. Observations show that despite shedding material, its internal cohesion remains strong, as though it were made of something denser, tougher, perhaps metallic. If it were composed primarily of iron or nickel, it might explain the stability. Yet that too would be puzzling, because such metallic bodies are rare among comets and more common in planetary cores. Could 3I Atlas be a chunk of a planet long destroyed? Or something engineered to endure the cold void between stars? Adding to the intrigue is its chemical fingerprint. Spectral analyses reveal an unexpected similarity between the environment around 3I Atlas and the atmospheric and surface composition of Mars itself. Trace gases and reflective signatures hint at materials consistent with iron oxide, the same compound that gives Mars its reddish hue. This has led to speculation that the object could have originated from a planetary surface, possibly from a world with conditions strikingly similar to Mars, or even from Mars itself, ejected long ago by a colossal impact. The odds of such an event are vanishingly small, yet not impossible. Still, if it did not come from our solar system, then its composition raises a more unsettling possibility, that Mars-like planets, perhaps even habitable ones, exist elsewhere, and 3I Atlas is a tiny messenger from one of them. Now, as it speeds through the inner solar system at a breathtaking 200,000 miles per hour, the interstellar traveler known as 3I Atlas races ever closer to its perihelion, the point at which it will skim nearest to the sun before being flung once again into the depths of interstellar space. Each passing day brings it deeper into a realm of increasing radiation and solar heat, a crucible that tests the limits of its mysterious composition. Astronomers across the world watch with bated breath, uncertain what will happen next. Will the immense temperature differences and solar wind strip away its outer layers, revealing what lies beneath? Or will the object endure unscathed, its internal structure so dense, so alien in composition, that it shrugs off the sun's fury as if built for the void itself? As it continues its descent toward the heart of our solar system, every telescope, orbital probe, and ground-based observatory that can possibly track it is now aimed at its faint, vanishing glow. The closer it gets, the harder it becomes to see, the sun's glare drowning out the fragile light it reflects. Yet scientists persist, desperate to capture any hint of change in brightness, color, or trajectory before it disappears into the blinding brilliance of daylight. Each new measurement could hold a clue to its origins. There's even hope that, as the object heats up, thermal stress might cause it to fracture, cracking open like an ancient seed to reveal its inner structure. Such a breakup would offer invaluable data about its composition, density, and magnetic properties. But there's also the haunting possibility that it will resist disintegration entirely, that its compactness and mass are far beyond what any natural comet or asteroid should possess.
In that case, it may simply pass through perihelion untouched, gliding silently past the sun before slingshotting back toward the stars, never to be seen again. If that happens, humanity will be left with only the faint data it managed to record, ghostly images, fragments of spectra, and endless questions. For now, observatories from Arizona to Chile, from Europe to Japan, are working in unison to monitor 3i Atlas's faint shimmer. Meanwhile, Mars orbiters and Earth-based telescopes continue to analyze residual dust trails in case the object reignites with activity. The Martian sky is being scanned daily as scientists hope to detect new outbursts or a resurgence of its weak tail. Yet, even if it reappears, one profound mystery refuses to fade. Why did 3i Atlas's arrival seem so perfectly timed? The probability of an interstellar body aligning its trajectory to pass so close to three major planets, Mars, Venus, and Jupiter, within such a short window of time is vanishingly small. To intersect not just the solar system, but the precise orbital plane where most planets travel, stretches coincidence to its breaking point. Was it a random alignment dictated by chance and gravity? Or does this seemingly choreographed passage hint at a deeper, hidden pattern we have yet to recognize? Some theoretical physicists have suggested that 3i Atlas might have been subtly gravitationally guided, drawn along invisible paths sculpted by planetary and solar resonances. A few, venturing further into speculation, have even asked the unthinkable. Could such precision suggest a deliberate trajectory? Could the object, or whatever remains at its core, have been designed to move purposefully through systems like ours, guided not by chance but by intention? Astronomers remain cautious about drawing extraordinary conclusions regarding 3i Atlas, yet its mysterious behavior continues to both intrigue and puzzle the scientific community. Every new observation challenges existing models of how celestial objects should behave. To many researchers, 3i Atlas seems to exist on the boundary between the known and the unknown, a cosmic anomaly that refuses to fit into any familiar category. If this interstellar visitor is a natural formation, it may have originated from a distant and ancient region of the galaxy perhaps forged in the frozen outskirts of a long-dead star system or within the dense clouds that existed before the Milky Way's spiral arms even took shape. In that case, 3i Atlas would be a kind of galactic fossil, carrying within it the chemical memory of the early universe, a fragment of time older than our Sun, Earth, and all life we know. Yet some scientists dare to consider another, more unsettling possibility, that it might not be natural at all. If 3i Atlas were artificial, it could represent evidence of ancient extraterrestrial technology, a probe or relic sent adrift through interstellar space, surviving countless millennia as it silently witnesses the birth and death of worlds. Now, as it hurtles toward the sun at unimaginable speed, humanity watches with a mix of wonder, fear, and hope. Whether 3i Atlas burns away in solar heat, breaks apart into fragments, or survives untouched to continue its eternal voyage, it has already transformed our understanding of what might exist beyond our solar system. Whatever its origin, 3i Atlas remains both a mystery and a mirror, a reminder of how small we are in the vast cosmic sea, yet how boundless our curiosity and determination to uncover the truth truly are.